Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, Rad here from Radko Tarot and this is going to be Capricorn Sun, Capricorn Moon and Capricorn Rising Weekly Tarot Reading July 30th to August 5th 2018 So the first card for Capricorns which uh, marks the topic of their week, this is going to be the Eight of Cups Second card represents the core of the situation for them, that is going to be the Four of Cups Third card represents the um, challenges that they that they need to overcome this is going to be the knight of cups and the last one is temperance which represents the guidance all right so um you're gonna find yourself aggravated due that week guys now these couple of cards are the same as they, they were in sagittarius's reading but because we do have the eight of cups here instead of the hangman it they do speak different story so what happened here is that you are going to have a um let's say a kind of like um a lack of synchronization with somebody now this again um speaks about a person but uh, lack, uh, the lack of the synchronization will not be in the goal the lack of the synchronization will be the execution of that goal so for example if you are um, in relationship I'm giving the relationship as an example because we do have a lot of cups, cups card here but if in one relationship uh, you and your partner may kind of like plan a vacation all right so the vac the vacation will be the goal of both of you but you may have a difference in the place that that vacation should take place all right so um, for example your partner may vote for dubai and you may want to go to california all right or to ba to bahamas and this is what that week is going to go under. I mean, this kind of mismatching into opinion or execution of a common goal with that person. And the thing is that it's going to be very tough for you to overcome their opinion because they really, really want to do it their way. It is just, it seems that there is no other way around it. All right, because they th it's not that they think that they are more than you are, all right, but they think that they deserve whatever they are about to do, all right? They, they deserve the chance. And here, uh, the cards are saying that you should allow them to have what they, what they want, either because this is going to boost their self-confidence, self either because this is going to prove that you believe in them and that you love them, or just so they can see how wrong they are, all right? At the end, it will be beneficial for both of you. Because either way here with the Eight of Cups, this is going to be as well a week of something new emerging, all right? The old ways are giving, uh, are giving space to the new ways. Now, the person is walking away from the old ways here, the Empty Cups, all right? And it is finding new perspective behind the summits. Now, uh, of, co of course, you know, the summits represents predicaments and obstacles. And things are not going to go lightly for you, Capric Capricorns. I mean, there could be an argument, you know, there could be kind of like a, a, a poignant experience uh, at a certain point, one or both of you may uh, feel despondent about the situation and th th there will be no resolution, but resolution is going to be found. Now, the core of the situation, Four of Cups here, points that uh, you and your partner, that is very important, you and your partner or the person that you are dealing with, because that could be as well a co worker or a boss into your career or it could be as well a, a, a family member or a, a friend etc etc now you need to realize that the current um, standpoint that you do have against one another it is kind of outdated all right that is the core of the situation and yeah it worked thus far and it may work a little bit longer but some changes needs to happen you know some some readjustments of the rules of the game needs to take place that is displayed here by the temperance card and the temperance is a um, Guidance card in your case says that you have to be the one who makes the, fir the first jester, all right? So you need to show the jest of compassion, you need to show the jest of, uh, of compromise, so you can show the way of your partner, person of interest, etc., that this is the way how the things are supposed to work. With mutual understanding, you know, with, um, <clears throat> with kind of mutual compromises as well, with an act of solidarity, with an act of compassion, with an act of appreciation, if you want to say it that way, and, and honoring the foreign opinion. So as, as long as you honor their opinion, they will honor your opinion, and 
is inevitable that a, a common ground will be found. It is just none of you should bruise themselves upon the other. And this is why you're going to find yourself frustrated because it's going to be very hard um, showing that person that the compassion is the way, not the not the aggression, not the bruising side of the of the things, nor uh, the silent treatment that they as well may try to give you. All right, in an act of being mad and, and uh, kind of like angry at you, etc., etc. So <clears throat> I hope that this uh, that this uh, reading is gonna prepare you for what is coming because it's very I, I could say it's kind of crucial here of uh, how well your relationship with that person will move on forward you know is it going to be on an extreme or is it going to be extremely humble and um a very balanced that depends on what how you're going to play your cards during that week and with that being said this was your weekly tarot reading for july uh, 30th to august 5th 2018 i hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and in case you're interested in a private reading with me everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video rat signing out now see you next time bye